Welcome to Rehabilitoy. Welcome to the video series where I document the vehicles that I've purchased. Matchbox vehicles, 1970s vintage. Uh, this before you is the 1973 version of the Lamborghini Countach. This is not the first version that was produced by Matchbox. This is the later version, uh, the third iteration, as I understand it. Uh, this one is red with the number 8 imprinted on the hood. The first version of this vehicle was yellow with the number 3. Now, I am not trying to acquire all the different variations of these vehicles, so this one will suffice for my collection. And it matches the one that is featured on the box of the Cyclone 5000 race set from Matchbox. If you'd like to see that video, I will put a link to that right up here so that you can watch that. But this vehicle right here, uh, I will be racing on that track eventually, but I wanted to document it first. This particular vehicle I acquired from a private party, and it is in excellent condition. As you can see, there's very little in the way of wear. Uh, there's a little nick here or there, but not very much. And you can see that the engine in the rear, the top opens up so you can see that engine. This one has the blue-green glass, and it is a super-fast vehicle. Uh, this particular model, let's uh, turn this over so that you can see the base. There we go. And you can see that. Wheels are in very good condition, uh, very little play on this. Pull it up here to the camera so that you can see what's written on the bottom. This particular version is copyrighted 1973, which I believe Matchbox typically did, even if there were variations, they left the original copyright on the base. It is a super fast. I will be racing that on that track eventually, but I wanted to document it. I really enjoy the color on this car and also the tampos. These are uh, painted on. These are not decals, as was the case with some of the vehicles from this era, but these are painted on. And as soon as I have a chance to race this down the track, then I will also refer back to this vehicle to document it. I will also down in the uh, show notes down below, I will have a link to the fandom wiki article about this vehicle. There's not a lot available on it, uh, but what's there, you can look it up and see the different images of the different variations. As far as I can tell, the wheels on this vehicle, those are the only wheels that were ever available on this particular car in the various uh, variations. The original one, the yellow one, uh, only has a sticker. The number on the front is a sticker, not a tampo, and there are no other decorations on that vehicle. There is another variation released in 1975. It's black with a metal base and red tinted glass. I'm not sure if I've ever seen that one, to be honest. I have seen the yellow one a number of times, and of course the red one that I acquired. But anyway, thank you for watching the video, and I hope you come back and look at some of the other vehicles in my collection. Thanks for watching.